Okay, let's talk sketches. Okay, here we go. So Kafka, Nietzsche, and Kierkegaard walk into a bar. Uh, and then we just improv the rest. Nice, perfect, yeah. love it. Yeah. Ooh, okay, what about a sketch for I'm a dog, and you guys are dog catchers. <laughs> 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 you know what? I think I want to be a character. Yeah. 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 Yes. yeah. yeah. Right? Right? Oh, yeah. Um, oh, yeah. What about a sketch about trolls? Like internet trolls? It's been done. I've I seen it. No, 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 no. Like people that don't like what they watch online in their mom's basements and we're like, Argh! Oh, yeah, we can be like, oh, that's, yeah. that's really good. Yeah. That's, yeah. That's, that's, that's good. That's good. Um, no, more like the midnight trolls that come and eat your family. Huh. Oh, you know what? I think I know what he's talking about. So I dated a girl that was half puppet, but mm. she talked about midnight goblins? Yeah, trolls, goblins, same thing. But would anyone other than the puppets get it? Oh, no. <laughs> oh yeah. Bring it in, guys. Bring it in. Thanks for having us. It's really? great times. Everyone, everyone, please, please clap this way, please. Go right. That one's awesome. It hurts when I go. Oh, God. Oh, Are you just making us Stevie Wonder? <laughs> hey! Hey, everybody. Hey. 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 Hey, welcome to your show. <laughs> This is a show from the Valley Folk. Uh, my name is Elliot, this is Steve, that's Lee, that's Joe. This is a show where uh, we used to do many things. It used to be a variety show, it's still a variety show, but uh, Joe, why don't you explain what's going on? Yeah, we're just, uh, uh, you saw the first three episodes of this show, really long, 22 minutes, a lot of bits in it. The problem with that is, is that some of that stuff wasn't being seen, so we're trying something different. We're lifting the bits out, throwing them out earlier in the week. Uh, news is gonna be every Thursday, and then Tuesdays is probably gonna be out yonder, whatever we feel like doing, maybe some kind of a fun challenge video. Uh, and then this show will be a mixture of sketch and us hanging out and other little segments that we throw together that we feel inspired to do. Ooh, ooh, Joe, yes, Joe, ooh. please. Uh, uh, and the fun little extra bit that we're gonna try is for those that really liked your show in its entirety oh, yeah, uh, in the first three episodes, is it good? we're still gonna do that, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a watch party over on Twitch where we watch that entirety with you and we do director's commentary and stuff like that. Guys, it's an ever-changing, ever-growing, ever-loving ever channel and we're doing it for you guys, we're doing it for us. We're doing it for, we're doing it for reasons. You. You're smart. You're a smart person. You're beautiful. And you're beautiful. You know, you didn't make yourself beautiful. That's just happenstance. Your parents your DNA did, did that. You did your hair today and it looks great. It does it looks incredible. You have a little thing right there on the left side. I'm not trying to I can hear. Star yeah. wife. Oh god. Can you uh can you read that one? Lee, the top one? Uh Guinevere Clark said if one of you were to take over the world and rule over it as a tyrant, which one would it be? <laughs> Jeff McClellan says the following. This really isn't a funny question, so probably won't make it into the show. Wrong. But in your opinions, is it better to chase your dream career, even if it's incredibly risky and you're unlikely to make it, or is it better to settle for a more safe, secure career and use your free time for your dreams slash the things you love? Wow, Ask this in a year. Yeah, yeah, I was gonna say this. <laughs> this completely <laughs> pertains to what we're doing. Uh, what do you guys think? I have this is like a I big, feel like heavy. Question. You have a very, you have a, a very big opinion on this, is what I remember. The whole chasing your dreams. It, it's the it's the concept of like you may not be working your perfect job, and because of that, your job isn't worth. But that's not true. You work so you can enjoy the rest of your life. Mm -hmm. You don't work just to enjoy work. You work right. to make everything else yeah. that is part of your existence well, yeah. fulfilled. The hope is that you can do both. Yes. So I can't say what is better because there's times where you're doing what you think is the best job and you go home and those moments are still going to be your better moments. I don't know. Yeah. Right, and even when you have a job you love and yeah. you feel like you've got the perfect job, it's still going to be a job. Yes. There's still gonna be aspects of yeah. it that eventually will get old Yeah, and you suck. know that phrase, if you love what you do, you never work a day in your life. It's full bullshit. Like if you love what you do, you're going to be working every day of your life in order to maintain mm -hmm. that love and passion of what you do. I would say if that thing in the back of your mind is always gonna be a what if, then you have to answer that what if. I also yes. think I have multiple friends that have had this dream of something and then it, they like do something where they'll move away or they'll do a lot of different things and we think it's them giving up, but then a lot of times it's like, 
my dreams changed. Yeah. Yeah, my dream was to do this. I realized that's never going to be what I want it to actually be. And at the end of the day, like we're all going to end up in a dark, lonely box. Really? I mean, let's be honest. We're going to get to a point where we're going to look back on our lives and say, like, oh, too late. <laughs> <laughs> Go to the next keyframe, mask out my hand, okay. and then the copy machine talks. Wow! Am I gonna need thumbs for this? Here's your drink! Whiskey on the rock! Oh, and it's, uh, they're, they're real rocks. Yep. Pop some leaves in there, too. Oh, you did. Look at that. It's an actual leaf from outside. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome! I can't do anything today. It's 11 a.m. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's a Roger Rabbit joke. It is. Yeah, uh, Robin Brandt says, how and when did you lose your virginities? Have we all talked oh, about this I at some point? I don't want to talk about this, Elliot. That's mean. <laughs> it's of course we're not going to talk about it. <laughs> you can't just assume that I'm not going to talk about when I lost my virginity. Right. Lost my virginity to my ex-wife. <laughs> <laughs> we met in high school. Hold on, hold on. Can I tell my story? Yeah. yeah. I lost my virginity uh, to my ex-wife. Um, we met in high school. Okay, I will actually say this. I lost my virginity to Elliot's ex-wife. <laughs> <laughs> and I lost my virginity to high school. <laughs> it's just, cut to Joe just humping a basketball hoop. There he is, look at him, he's a high schooler. Okay. Hey, Principal McKinnon. We have to do something about all the holes in the wall. Yeah, I think so. I don't really know. Hey, I don't know if this level. is. I think it might actually break. This gouge is gonna break. This gouge is break. Oh, couch! I can't do anything right. Oh, I know. Maybe I'll clean. No, Mr. Scoos. I, I clean. I clean. You get that? Focus. Ready? Yeah. Steve, ready? Mm. Elliot. I love this hat. No, not use your hair. Oh. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, John Warner asks, can Elliot's Southern radio host give love advice to Julian? To Julian? To Julian. Wow, Julian is a character I used to do. Oh yeah! Hello there everybody, welcome back to Love Advice. Uh, I am your host, Dr. Love, and uh, I'm spinning all the, the current classic hits for you here. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take our, our final call of the evening uh, and- Hello? Uh, oh. Uh, we're on the line now with uh, Julian. Julian. Yeah. Julian, how are you? <laughs> okay, Julian. So, what brings you to uh, Doctor Love? What's up? Well, I'm Julian. Hi, Julian. <laughs> Welcome to Doctor Love. What kind of advice can I give you? I'm Julian. Yes, you are. You are Julian. You're a good Julian too. Now, what can I give you in terms? Oh, of, oh all right. <sighs> well. Okay, Julian. I went into the market and I went to buy an app, an apple. And then I, and I went up to the woman who said, Where's, how much is the weight of this thing gonna cost for you, sir? Uh-huh, and did you find her attractive? Hold on, hold on, I gotta put you on hold. Hello? You just pushed the pound button and you pressed 16. Is it hot pizza? Pizza. Okay, bring it in. Hello? Julia, I think you're on the line again with me. So oh, you want okay. to try Hold one? On. Okay. 
Hello? Give, give Julian. Pizza. No, Julian, I don't have a pizza, pizza. for you, Julian. I, I actually am a, a, a radio host of a program. Okay. Called... I got, all right. All right. Last evening, I was bit by a lobster, and I've not had the best rest of the night. So what's happening now is I'm just trying to eat a pizza, pizza. and I'd like to know if when I bought an apple, the girl wanted to go out on a date mine. Julian, Hello? Uh, I can actually help you. But in terms of this lady with the apple, do you... Do you okay, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, Julian, are you feeling okay physically? The <laughs> other side of my stomach hurts. The other side? Okay. I'm talking to you when you sit down, your chair has a kiss for it. Okay. All right, Julian, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to turn you off. Uh, and thank you so much, everybody, for listening to Dr. Love. Pizza. That pizza better be hot or there's going to be one more answer from me at the end of the night. Oh, man. I feel like it should have been Ugh. Julian's advice show. I don't know. I don't much to say. I just I read about a book a year. We got something to yeah. do should, oh. we do, should we kick oh. out the end of the show? Oh. <laughs> I'm worried about it. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted a little bit. Hey, we're going to go. Hey, we're going to. We're going to okay? go. We're going to. Oh, oh, okay. Well, hey, thank you so you guys, much. Thanks, yeah. guys. Let us know in the comments uh, if you like the new format and how we're, we're going to be rolling out content, all of that. Um, share the videos, that really helps. And, uh, oh, and subscribe. And yes. <laughs> all that. Oh, my God. We're going to follow us on Twitter. We'll be doing the Twitch thing That's soon. That's so gross. God. Did you see what he did? That's <laughs> gross, man. <laughs> gross. It's funny. 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 <laughs> Kevin's died. Oh. I'm sorry I didn't grow up in the city. <laughs> All right. Truly sorry I didn't grow up in the city. I'm shook. Oh, was that spit? Oh, I, didn't I, didn't I, spit I didn't have a chance to go to school like somebody else did. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs>